Don't fight. Don't fight. Don't fight. Don't fight. You have any idea on you? Don't fight. No, okay, okay. Why are you carrying a handgun? Why didn't you call the police? Easy. Ecstasy. Do you know what 700 ecstasy pills would do to you? You have no idea. It would overheat you like a pot of boiling water and turn your brain into jello. Right now, we got dispatched to a local business here where an intoxicated male was sleeping on the ground in a handicap zone. At the same time, we got a call of a male in the parking lot trying to get into vehicles. So we don't know if this guy's vehicle prowling or, or what he's doing. So we're going to go see what's going on with him. There. How you doing, guy? Go ahead and stand up. Turn around from. Turn away from me, all right? Put your hands on top of your head for me. Spread your feet three feet apart. Interlace your fingers. You ain't got no weapons on you right now? No you ain't got no weapons, right? Do you have any weapons? Hey, grab his left hand. Let's cuff him yeah. up. No, he's not, he's not responding. He's, uh, got it? One, two, three. Don't fight. Oh, don't fight. He's grabbing me. Five, five, secure the channel. We're fighting. Five, we're fighting. Stop resisting! Stop resisting! Stop resisting! He's Stop! Stop! his weight, man. Watch your gun! Don't fight, Give Daddy. Your You're gonna get no. tased. You're gonna get tased. Don't I got fight. one hand. I got one. I don't really get tased. I got the... Okay. Aim another one. Got it? Yep. You're okay. under arrest. Stand up for me. There we go. Hold on, hold on. Check him. We haven't checked him for weapons. Right. There you go. You got any weapons on you, partner? Can you give me an audible answer this time? Okay. You do have weapons. Where? Okay, I'm not feeling anything. Turn around, grab a seat for me. What were you thinking? We're here trying to help you, and you started tensing up and pulling away from us. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why are you laughing? You what? You thought we were laughing at you? Is that what you said? Stand up for me. Come on over here. Come sit in the back of a car for a minute, all right? Relax for me, all right, guy? Go ahead and grab it. You don't want that. You got your pants? All right, go ahead and grab a seat for me. Sit down. Sit down. There you go. Put both feet in there. Why did you decide to tense up on us and stuff like that? You don't know? Did you know you tensed up on us and tried to pull away? Boy, they, 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 huh? You did? Well, what made you do that? Um, natural instinct. That's natural true. instinct takes over? Yeah. All right. You hang out for me. Watch your knee. I got a call at the front of the store saying there was an intoxicated gentleman up here. Went and approached him. The gentleman got up and started leaving the building. I could tell he was really wobbly on his feet. So we just kind of followed him outside to see what he was going to do. He attempted to get into a green Volkswagen bug, which obviously did not belong to him. Or about. Then. Right over in the handicap spot. Oh, okay, right over here near us. Time. And then he tried to get into this green vehicle. And at that point, he was so ahead. wobbly. We asked him to sit down before he fell over and somebody hit him with the car. Okay. So he sat there, um, huh? and then it was within about a minute you guys showed up. Hey, man. What happened before we got here? I don't know. Like the whole family. His name of And friends, family, all, all of them. They cut all ties to me, too. They cut all ties to you? Mm -hmm. Do you remember sleeping in a handicap stall over here? I do not know that. Did you see us drive up? Mm, yeah. Yeah? Did you know we were the police? Yeah. yeah. How did you know we were the police? Because it uh, looks like a top car. OK, and did you see us in uniform? Yeah. yeah. Well, you stood up, turned around, put your hands on top of your head when I told you to. Yeah? I mean, you followed my commands there. I just don't understand why you decided to try and resist us when we were just trying to make sure you didn't have any weapons on you. I don't know. I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened. If I knew what was happening with me and why I did the shit I do, I wouldn't be doing what I do. What, 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 do you, what are you high on, bud? Not the Xanax. Xanax? How much have you taken? Two. Two Xanax? OK. What does Xanax do to you? Shut up, please. Nobody's Xanax? behind you. Xanax kind of makes you feel you slur your words like this and stuff? Yeah. Okay. Does it make you hallucinate at all? Yeah. No? Well, who are you just talking to behind you? You just said, shut up, please, and you look behind you. 
Mm -hmm. All right. There you go. Watch your knee, bud. There you go. I'm going to close the door here. We'll take him for it. Disorderly and obstructing. Oh, yeah, on it. You are kidding me. He's got a protection mask, scanner, handgun. Was there a round in the chamber? Round in the chamber, ready to go. All he needs to do is squeeze the trigger. Right now, we're going to be the primary unit on a attempt warrant service for a wanted subject who's allegedly carrying a handgun and has previous violent history with police officers in the past. You there, 428? Stilicum's gonna post. Let's go to the bar first. Put the phone down. Excuse me, sir. What? What's the name? Kelly? Um, Relax. Is this bag? Is this your bag? Yeah, sure. Okay. Yeah. Do you have any ID on you? Uh, no, I don't. Oh, oh, okay. Do you have any ID on you? Yes, sir. Don't fight. No, okay, okay. okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, God. Whoa. Don't. Put your hand behind your back now. Put your hand behind your back. Tase him. Okay, okay, okay. Tase him. Ow, ow, ow. Ow, 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 ow. You're under arrest. Relax. 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 All right. Um. Whoa, whoa. Back tight. This is metal in the pocket. What you got? Okay. Yo, whoa. What the f Some stand up. Go ahead and sit up. Oh, wow. Let's take him outside. This is our guy. He matches the description in the last booking photo. Yeah, Clear it outside. <clears throat> Why are you carrying a handgun? Because these people are Why didn't you call the police? I tried to. Earlier. No, you didn't. We have no I record didn't. of you calling 911. I, I know, sir. All right? And it's not mine. I, it's not yours, but it's in your pants, right? No, no. Oh, oh, hell no. Well, this gun was loaded. It's like a star, 9 millimeter. The slide is locked. I'm going to have to work on it to make sure there's not a round in the chamber. Mark, you want to clear this for me? I can't get the slide open. I don't know if it's stuck or not. Good, good job. Mark, where did you find that on him? Thanks, man. It was man. in the uh, right sleep. waistband? Or is it left side? I'm going to bet you $10 that thing's stolen. No, because the guy is, a, he's an older man. And he's a drug dealer, big time Mexican. Did he tell you it wasn't stolen? Yes, sir. When did you buy it? Just a few minutes ago. Did you load a round into the chamber, or did you ever no, look? Bob, just like that. So you never ensured that there was a round in the chamber, because no, we're, we're checking it right now. No, sir, I did not. So were you carrying it for your protection, because people are out to get you? Yes, sir. And you tried to call 911, but you couldn't get through on your cell yes, phone? the cell phone was dead. The cell phone was dead. But you were on the phone when we walked in and contacted yes, you. Yes, I was trying. Who were you talking to? To the lady right across the street from the trailer that has all the drugs. She was trying to help me. Trying to help you do what? Trying to help me contact the police, sir. She, her name is Lisa. You okay. Nine one one yourself. I wasn't Line was tied up though, right? That looks like crystal meth there. That's pretty good stuff. Yeah. Nice. So who did you, who did you buy this from? From the Mexicans. Sir. From the Mexicans, okay. What, I, right. Why am I being arrested? I didn't. Believe All right, you're under arrest right now. I know that. Fifty thousand dollar domestic violence warrant, unlawful possession of controlled substance warrant, and then felon in possession of a handgun. I know, sir. Go ahead and get in the I'm car. Trying to, I'm yeah. trying to get my life straight. Please help me. Help you? help you? No. You got the original booking sheet? Yep. Oh, yeah, on it. You are kidding me. No, it's all came out of the little bag. It looks like, I don't know what his military He's got background a... is, but he has any military background or not, but. Protection mask, scanner, handgun. Was there a round in the chamber? Absolutely. Full magazine, round in the chamber, ready to go. All he needs to do is squeeze the trigger. Military gear ready to bear. Looks like he might have been thinking about doing a robbery. Hey, here's the deal. I'm going to work with you on the assault charge, like I told you, but you're in a ton of trouble for everything else. I'm not all right? a violent person. Sir. You're not a violent person. You have a violent background. You're carrying a firearm. I know. It's just for All right? Protection. That's five years. Yeah, five five years, years, mandatory minimum. That's Enjoy your last breath of fresh air for a while. Okay. You lied to me about your driver's license. Did you tell me your name was Brian? No, I said it was Anthony Brian. I don't think so. You said Christopher. Right. You didn't say anything about Brian. Explain that to me.
Awesome. Stop in the parking lot right here. These two guys were kind of walking across the street, looking around at everything. Don't know what business they have in the city. They might just be kids coming into the parking lot to shop, or they could be up to something. There's a lot of burglaries in this area. 1240 pet check. What's happening, man? Talk to you guys a minute. Chad? 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 Nice to meet you. Good reason. How are you doing? You guys on probation, parole, anything like that? No. Notice your haircut. It's pretty cool. Oh, thanks. You graduation parties tonight or what? No. Last year. Last year? Yeah. You got one more year? No. Last year. Last year, you Last year you all right. Yeah. You guys got your idea with you tonight? I actually uh, don't, don't have mine. Nothing at all? Nothing. Uh, I have no idea or anything. Where are you guys headed right now? Back to the laundromat. You got no ID in your wallet? Nothing, huh? You never been arrested for anything? Uh, I got in trouble in high school. Do me a favor, just take your hands out of your pocket. Oh, sorry, yeah. I haven't had you down or anything. I don't know what you got on you. Okay. You got in trouble for what? Uh, I had to stack a possession in high uh, what? school. Of ecstasy. Ecstasy? Like, uh, the pills on me. Come over here, okay? Let me just pay down, make sure you got nothing on you. You got nothing illegal going on, nothing like that? Turn around for me. Hey, why don't you pull your pants up for me, too? Okay. You a musician or what? You got anything in here? No, no I just lighter. Like just a lighter? Like no pipes? No, 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 no pipes. Is that a baggie right there? A marijuana? No. No? What's your first name? Uh, it's Chris. Or Christopher. How's it on your license? Christopher? Yeah. Keep your other hand out. I just was bored one day, you know? Go for it. BC. Ecstasy. Trans men are back. These both, these shirts are not even mine. Ecstasy my pills. Clothes. Oh my god. What? Are you kidding me? These are not my shorts. I'm washing my clothes. Wait, so you don't know what's in your shorts? No. So you're telling me you did not know that these ecstasy bags no. were in there? No, I did not. So when you put your lighter right in there, you didn't go, oh, what's that? Oh, my ecstasy pills? No, th those are not mine. I don't do X. OK, and what about these? Those are not mine. OK, do you have anything else on you that's illegal? No, sir, I do Because, not. you know, when I asked you, you kind of like, huh? And you stuttered a little no, bit. No, I didn't. You I did. told you I don't have anything illegal on yeah, you me. You said you're not sure. That's what you said. No, I don't think so. Go ahead, sir. You got uh, two guys here detained with about uh, 20 ecstasy pills if you want 87 down here. Oh, firm it around. So is this a burrito? Yes. Yeah, just came from me. No ecstasy in there? <laughs> I got to ask, right? Dude, I, like, I, I promise. I Come on, do, man. I don't do X. I don't do you lied to me about your driver's license. Oh, it's, it's invalid. Yeah, but you, did you tell me your name was Brian? Huh? You didn't tell your name was Brian, did you? No, I said it was Anthony Brian. I don't think so. Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. See, I wrote it down. You said Christopher. Right. You didn't say anything about Brian. You told yeah. me he didn't have a driver's license. So now you're lying. Right. Explain that to me. That ID is invalid. It doesn't matter. Does that mean your name's invalid? I don't know. I is your name Christopher, or is it the one on your ID? It's the one on the ID. OK, so, okay, so that, that's a valid ID, then. Right? No, it's it's a valid name on it and a valid date of birth. And what you gave me now is wrong, right? OK. You've been arrested for what now? I'm going to ask uh, you really to run your real name since you've been trying to uh, hide your identity from me. Why is that? Do you have warrants? Yeah. For what? Um, Failed to appear, and I think it was a DUI a long time ago, 17. OK, how old are you right now? 21. 21? OK. So we have a seat right here next to your partner. OK, so let me, let me get this straight. First of all, you tell me you have nothing on your, in your person, right? right? That's your first lie. Second lie, you told my partner you never had an identification on you, right. which you did. So that's your second lie. I okay? Did lie. okay then you lied. Hold on a second. Let me finish. Then you lied to me about your name. That's your third lie. Now, you honestly expect me not to believe that you don't know anything about the ecstasy pills that are found in your pants pockets where you placed your lighter? Yes. OK. And that's a story you want to go to the court and uh, on, right? These are not my shorts. They don't even fit you're, you're wearing them, right? They look like they fit you. Because I went to go wash clothes. Oh, tell us whose shorts they are. I'll be happy to go arrest someone who gave the ecstasy in there. All right, stand up for me. If I can. You're being placed under arrest for possession of ecstasy for sales. That's a big, big bag of ecstasy, isn't it? Yeah. Do you know what 700 ecstasy pills would do to you? It would oh, overheat man. you like a pot of boiling water and turn your brain into jello. Uh, we just had a red prelude go by us full of, uh, had a bunch of male subjects in it. Looked really suspicious at us. We're going to try to catch up to them here and just kind of see what's going on. 
That was it? I know who it is. It's, um... Hi. Hi. How are you guys doing? Hi. This your current address on 134th? Okay, what year's your car? No, what year is your, oh, your car? car uh, 90. 90? 90, 90 okay. Talk to you for a second out here, please. Uh, what are those pills in your pocket there? Mark, 61 now. This one? 61. Okay. Hands behind your back. Put your hands on your head now. Don't move. That's a big, big bag of ecstasy, isn't it? Yeah. That's a huge bag of ecstasy. I look fine to the chest. Step, step it up to code two for a minute, please. Keep that hand there. Step out slowly. Keep that hand up in the air. It's a big bag of ecstasy. I got him. Will you get that guy? Yeah. They're ecstasy, right? I don't know. I just picked up in the garbage. Oh, OK. Yeah, you told me before they were ecstasy. Yeah, they sure are. That's a lot of ecstasy, my friend. How many think are in there? I don't know. You gave it to me for 100 bucks. That was a deal, so I just buy it, I guess. For 100 bucks? Yeah. What did you think it was when you bought it? He said you some ecstasy. OK. I, I told him I said. I, I take a lot of them. You take a lot of them? Yeah. Well, there's about seven lifetime supplies right there. Thank you for telling the truth, because we've been lied to by everybody all day long, and uh, you're the first person I mean, that's been I honest with us. Like, you know, some guy, okay. like, I was at the store, and he told me, like, hey, I got some ecstasy for cheap. And I'd be like, OK. And then I pretty much, I got like, I told him I got like 100 bucks in my pocket. And, so you paid a hundred dollars for yeah. this ecstasy? Yeah, he said it's not even that good. So I, he said, if, like, you take ten of them, like, it regularly will be like one of them. So he told me. So okay. And how many pills did he tell you were in here? Like seven. That what he say. Seven. Yeah. Like seven hundred. Yeah. Okay. And he sold you seven hundred ecstasy pills for. For like a hundred dollars. A hundred dollars. I mean, you think you could have turned around and maybe made just a little bit of money off of these then? I don't know. Probably think, just a little. At ten bucks a pill. I don't know. I'm thinking about just taking them. Much. You're gonna take 700 ecstasy pills? Yeah. Do you know what 700 ecstasy pills would do to you? You have no idea. It would I'm overheat just... you like a pot of boiling water and turn your brain into jello. Yeah. I'll do you lot, know you're not though. gonna take 700 ecstasy pills, and I know that. How long have you known these guys in the car? Both of them related. You know. Did they know about the ecstasy in no, your pocket? They, to they had nothing to do with it. Yeah, they, 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 they called them up and asked them for a ride. So. Okay. All right. Well, we're gonna have you sit back in the car, okay? And we'll get we'll get going. Go ahead and have a seat. When did you guys get the ecstasy? How long ago was it? I think it's like 30 minutes ago. 30 minutes ago. And where did you guys get it from? Huh? Oh, at home. At home? Yeah. Who brought it to you? Huh? Who brought you the ecstasy? I don't know. You don't know the guy's name? No. How much money did you put in to uh, buy for this ecstasy? I didn't put in anything. Well, that's not what your buddy's telling us. How much did you put in? Huh? How much I money? Gave him, I gave him, two, I gave him like, like two, 250 for it. You gave him 250? Yeah. And how much was he putting in on top of that? I don't know. Okay, come on, let's go back and sit in the car. Those cups better? Okay, you. you bet. You're welcome. Can I get my contact water? Yeah, we'll get all that for you, okay? You bet. Have a seat. We're going to arrest the front seat passenger for delivery and possession. The uh, driver admitted to help him pay for the ecstasy. Uh, so he's going to go for the same charges. It's been a long time since our team's seen this much ecstasy.